doing? Get up! Get up! This is no such time for a nap! Oh good god, Julia, will you leave me alone and let me sleep? Let me have one more hour of that time. Why you get off the bed? And you, Juliet, get up! This is no such time to be asleep! What the heck is this racket? And what are you doing to my daughter? Juliet, get up this instant! Me and your father are looking forward to this day. So I swear on God's great grace that if you miss this day, then you will never, and I mean never, see the light of day once more. You got that, lady? Yeah, I really have no words. I haven't felt this much dismay since I saw my future bride for the first time. Why? I thought the marriage would end hastily now. See, 14 years later, and I'm still stuck with this woman. Ah. Juliet, why won't you get up? My daughter, please. My lady, she's not responding. I think she's moved on. <laughs> But my, my daughter! Look, maybe it's for the best. She's probably doing much better up above than now. You have no need to worry. I'm sure she didn't die in any pain. You should take rest in the fact that she died in peace. She's dead, you say? Oh my god, Capulet, what are you wearing? Everyone relax, I've got this situation under control. Lady Capulet, nurse, anyone infected with the body, move to the far corner of the room this instant! And Paris, come out from behind that potted plant, assist me with the body. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. That's my future br uh, bride that we're talking about. Yup, dead as a doornail. Oh boy, she's not coming back. That shock would have stopped her heart tenfold. Now you really get it. You killed her. You just killed my bride. <gasps> Cold skin, still blood, stiff limbs. Look, there's nothing I could do. I was this close to inheriting the capital of bonds. $4.3 million? What, would, what I would do with that kind of money? And here I am. No wife, no assets, no kids. I'm gonna die alone with nothing. Guys, guys, be quiet for a moment. Look, maybe we do deserve this. Paris, you didn't do this for Juliet, and I only did this to fund our advertisement campaign. We were so focused on our personal gains that, didn't, that we didn't have time to pay attention to what Juliet really wanted herself. Maybe her death is a sign from the heavens that we need change. While she resides peacefully above, while we below are burdened within our sorrows. Do not cry for this loss of life before our lack of morals our choices have led. Take this as a lesson to not put our greedy desires ahead of the lives of others. I don't care what the freer says. We spent all this money setting up the party, inviting the guests, creating the flyers. Look, yeah, my daughter is dead, but this wedding cost us some big bucks. Heck, I even got angel investors to come to the party. What am I going to tell them? My daughter just happened to die on the day we would meet. They would just think I'm chickening out. I'm making the Forbes 30 under 30, not the Forbes losers under 40. Why couldn't my wife just join her? 14 years is definitely enough time for something to go wrong. My sweet daughter, why did you have to die so early? You had so much to live for, yet death stole you away so quickly. Lady Capulet. It will be hard, but we will endure. Peter, go fetch the musicians. We must, we must tell them to. What's the long face for? It's a bad omen to be anything but happy for a wedding, you know. Where's the bride? The heavens, good sir. Is there anything you would like us to do? Leave us! Leave! Leave! Yes, yes, sir! <laughs> Wait, where did Juliet go? <coughs> Come on.